Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video I'm gonna show you guys how you can link an EA account to your PlayStation 5. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm gonna show you. As you can see guys, I'm right now in this browser on my computer. So just go ahead and open your browser on any device. Once you do that, go ahead and click on the search bar and then search for EA like this. Then go ahead and click on the first link, www.ea.com. And then once you do that, right here, as you can see, guys, this is how the homepage looks like. Right here in the top, right, you're going to find your profile. Here you're going to find help. And here you're going to find EA. So go ahead and click on profile. And then once you do that, right here, you're going to find two options, sign in. And here you're going to find the option to create an account. Go ahead and click on sign in. And then once you do that, this will take you to this page. Once you're here, as you can see, guys, you're gonna find sign in. Here you're gonna find external login via EA account or internal login via Okta. So right now, go ahead and click on external login via EA account. And then once you do that, you're gonna be here in this page. Once you're here, as you can see, guys, you can sign in to your EI account using your phone or email. Here, you can sign in using your password. And right here, as you can see, guys, in the top, you can either use your Google account to sign in. You can use Facebook, Apple. Here, you're going to find Steam, Xbox. And lastly, right here, you're going to find PlayStation Network account. So basically, guys, if you want to link your EA account with your PlayStation 5, just go ahead and click on PlayStation. and then just go ahead and uh, log in using your PlayStation account. They're gonna ask you if you want to create an account with EA, and then just go ahead and follow the steps. Then you're gonna be able to link your EA account to your PlayStation account. You can also log into your EA account normally, and from there, you can uh, search for add platform and then add your PlayStation account. So this is it guys for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.